writing and talking about the letter and then finalizing it was a bit of a catharsis. I doubt my children will ever finish reading the chapter. So I did it more for myself than for them. My mother will read the chapter for sure. Uh, so I think it was uh, just about, you know, saying things that sometimes are difficult to say face to face as your children, in my case, my daughters get older, they know more than us, they're more intelligent than us, they're wiser than us. There has been, but we have our story and we want to talk about it. So, Sudha, thank you. I think uh, there are a couple of uh, things. First of all, I'd say that uh, writing this uh, letter was actually a lot of fun, but also very thought provoking because in our day to day interactions. I just love Sudha, she's just really, really <laughs> wonderful. But I actually haven't had a chance yet to read the book because as soon as I got the book, my mom grabbed it and took it. And so my mom's reading the book right now. But she did call me and say, oh my God, Shaheen, why is yours so short? Everybody else's is so long. Why don't you write more? And I remember when I was asked um, to write it, I actually just sat down and wrote it really, really quickly. Um, and on reflection, maybe that's because I, I think inside I, I know what's important. Um, for me to give to my girls. And then just a couple of lines. Um, I'd show you the times when I was really myself, when I did what I believed in, when I followed my heart, when I tried to live my potential. And I think that's what I really, really want for my kids. Um, the ability to see me for who I am and who I'm not, to see the things that I do well and also the things that I don't do well, and to be able to think of themselves as really human and really special and to try to take the small steps forward and backwards towards their own potential. So speaking for myself, it was a, a, a wonderful emotional journey. Uh, you thought of uh, uh, things that happened when your children were in nappies, when they went to their first day of school. Uh, so you relived a lot of memories through writing that chapter. The journey of writing this book was completely transformational for me. I started out on this process uh, a bit uncertain because I was not sure what I was getting into, whether I'd be able to um, get across to these people and convey what I wanted from them. But I met them and I interviewed them for uh, you know very extensively. And I realized that when a parent talks about uh, the daughter, it is always so much more special, you know, all the things that are really important in their lives, all the simple things, the simple values, the honest values, all of them came out. And in a way, listening to them tell about what are the important things in life, you know, honesty, sincerity, hard work, dignity, respect for other people, um, it changed my life forever. I, I, I started out being a, a cynic, and by the time I was finished with the book, I think I have caught the positivity that uh, they talk about all the time.